Kai Mise made remarks after visiting the site to familiarize with the development of the project. Located near the southern harbour town of Ludritz, the wind farm will consist of 11 turbines with a total capacity of 44 megawatt. It will represent 5 to 6 percent of the country's electricity consumption, producing approximately 4,000 giga hours annually. The reason why we are here is to experience and to actually attest to the work that has been done to date. Uh, so it's also within our mandate to inspect rather than just uh, doing our work from the offices. Uh, so that's why we are here with our delegation as a regulator to verify. Kai Mise noted the project signifies a significant step to reducing the country's reliance on imported electricity, which currently accounts for about 50% of its power supply demand. So every locally generated unit that is far below the expensive imports, it is encouraged and supported. So we are here to realize the government dream of not only connecting the unconnected, but also in making electricity affordable to the Namibian consumers. The CEO further said the country's future lies in achieving an optimal energy mix that combines large-scale solar and wind power, complemented by battery storage systems to ensure stable base load. The CEO of InnoVent was also part of the delegation that visited the construction site. I've been uh, um, blessed to be the one installing the free turbine, the free wind turbine we are already producing since seven years in uh, Luderitz. That was a pilot project on medium voltage. Here we are on a pilot project on high voltage, meaning that out of here we are part of the national grid and we are directly connected to Cocker Boom, to the 400 kilovolt line was a backbone, electricity backbone of Namibia. So here, thanks to all this installation done by Megatron, a Namibian uh, produ uh, company, we are part of the Namibian grid. Ten times what we are doing today will cover the whole needs of Namibia about on electricity. So that pilot project has to be just done again and again until we cover the world needs of Namibia in energy. The project will be completed in May next year. Lukman Kluter, NBC News, Diaz Wind Farm.